This channel does not promote or encourage any illegal activities. All contents provided by this channel is meant for educational purpose only. So hello guys, welcome back to another video of our channel. And in this video, we'll be taking a look on why we need to stop using Shodan and use Zoomai. But if you go in the video, we are having announcements here. We were having advanced best code. The registration are closed now, but you can still take a look on the content in the description. It was a complete advanced course for bug hunters. And also, we are having a new recorded course out. The information leaks. You can check out all the content and all the things here. The link is also in the description. And we'll be having few more videos and few more recorded courses on the way. So we'll be updating you. Stay tuned. And let's get into the video. So here we are on our computer screen now. So as you have seen in the previous uh, videos or in the previous sessions that we need to use Shodan for multiple things. But after all, this is a video then in which I'm going to show you why you don't need to Shodan and use Zuma instead. So look, I'm not saying that you don't need to use Shodan anymore. Shodan is good, but at some point I feel that Zuma can do better. So if you have been on Twitter, then you have seen that I am posting Shodan docs daily. I am just posting daily notes. On 14 December or on the day 57, we have seen Shodan docs, right? There is much more things, right? Uh, it's just a part one. The part two, three, four are on the way. So why am I saying that you need to stop using Shodan? So there is a thing that no matter if you are using the basic account or the premium account, you are having a lot of features, right? But on the same end, if you go to Zuma, it's very simple. So if you just take a look on this one, zuma.org, it's here. It's having a lot of features here, right? The hot search is, you can just search, uh, find details about a company or a target or organization using batch IP. You can use file search, you can use icon search, right? And many more things. We'll take a look onto them. It would be a very quick video onto that. So let's compare Shodan here. I'm just typing organization which is tesla.com cool let me hit enter nothing here okay so let's remove the .com as its organization so I've got around 5341 results let's type the same here we got 875 results so technically there is a lot more results than Shodan on Zuma. So, one more thing, uh, I have faced the issue while using Shodan. So, I have reported a bug, I found an IP using Shodan, like the site colon trick. So, I've used, I've got an IP about a target and I just, I was able to log into their admin portal, in short. So, when I reported them, they just told me that, no, it, it does, the IP does not belong to us. The Shodan is having its own DNS database. It is not giving us the exact results. I'll be including the screenshot here. So this is the issue I have found using Shodan in multiple targets. So on the same end, I have never found or faced this issue while using Zuma. So you can just, this is one more point that you should use Zuma instead of Shodan. But I will say for better results, use both of them. Anyway, so we are having one, uh, like few more options here, like the reports, maps, vulnerabilities. If you go on the report, you will get a report here, right? You can simply use it, the port statistics device maps a lot of things here right then you can take a look on this thing search type here and all these things anyway that's a simple one docking on Sudan is also uh, very complicated if I say because when you are on zoom I, it will help you dock a lot like I'm just going on here uh, it's it is also adding the time period here so let me just change it to 10 December so I want IPs after 10 December only so we have 1400 results amazing let me make it 14 december so we have got an around yeah 1483 ips let's change the number to 1 december or 01 1515 results out there crazy so this was just a single doc but if you just take a look on the home page and if you go to the search tool that's a whole tool for information or like uh, the Google Docs or the Shodan Docs, right? You can just type your anything here, port, or let's say you want uh, site. 
a simple one so i want site tesla.com now i want a port right so you can technically add multiple things here you can use this thing for time also on ssl based operating system devices right so technically it's a very good tool for uh, finding specific information on zoomai but if you want to create your own docs then you can go to this syntax descriptions it will help you a lot on it you can just have a clear look out on it you want some sort of filters on uh, services like cisco asa vpn organizations right you can specify it like that and there is one more crazy feature let me just show you on the vulnerability section you can see a lot of things here there is a lot of cvs right mentioned here so these are the things that are available that might be available on the particular websites so to view them or to just find on which ip this sort of cvs are vulnerable right you need to simply log in or register on to it if you are having an account you will be logging in using the telnet 404 you can just simply enter a email sms verification and registration success simple as that so you can do that have your own good recon using it so this was this uh, i was making a short video but if you want a longer video or a in depth video just uh tell me in the comment section i'll make a in depth video about zoomai and this is not all right there is a lot of other features to just take a look around so after this video i will say kindly go on to this website explore it by yourself explore it according to your uses what are you uh, going to use this on and uh, find all the features available on it and use it ac according to you we are also having the popular and hot searches many more things are here and i'll also mentioning documentation if i found about this particular website so that was for it see you guys in the upcoming video and don't forget to check out the links in the description